The past few years have only reaffirmed what I knew after that first meeting, after that first handshake, that I myself couldn't have picked a better person for my little sister. A toast to my daughter. She was a gift from God, and I will always be grateful to have been given the honor of being her father. May God continue to bless her and her new husband and grant them safety, love, and happiness all the days of their lives. I know I didn't have a choice in the matter, but I'm glad that you are my brother, and I have learned so much from you over the years, and I'm very proud of you. I can't wait to see what life has in store for you and Liz. I wish you both the love and happiness in your marriage. Oh my God, you look beautiful. You're handsome, right, Snazzy? Yeah, you're you're mic'd mic'd up. I am mic'd up. You're mic'd up. Now, you will say a few words that will take you across a threshold of life. And things will never quite be the same between you. For with these vows, you say to the world, this is my husband, and that is my wife. I promise to always be a true loyal partner to you. You're my best friend and one true love. And part of me today still can't believe that I'm the one who gets to marry you. I love you. I vow to cherish you and love you forever and stick by your side through all of life's challenges so I can be the wife you deserve. By the power vested in me, by the Universal Life Church, and by the great state of Ohio, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. I just wanted to thank everybody for coming, of course, and traveling far and close. Round of applause for our guests. Woo! Thank you guys again. Thank you, thank you.
not yet. Wow. Not yet. It's not amazing. Until it's so good. Oops, okay. Beautiful. Very good. Yes. <laughs> uh, no, we're mic'd uh, up. Oh no. <laughs> cut, cut that part out. 